everybody, welcome back to my channel. This is Kristen with Monarch Plans and today I am doing a plan with me in my Daily Duo planner. I actually have been using the Daily Duo a lot more recently just to plan out my days and just doing things a little bit differently. I usually use the Amplify planner but I just wanted something a little bit different. So I'm going to be doing a daily plan with me. This is the week that is leading up to our vacation and I have a lot of stuff going on, especially at the beginning of the week. I think I'll just do like two days and that will be it for this plan with me because the rest of the week, I don't even know at this point like what exactly I need to get done and my daily planner is really like specific tasks. So it really just kind of helps me out to plan a couple of days at a time and then just write down like all the remaining stuff. So if I plan out too far in my daily duo it or even any daily planner it just is I don't know it ends up being like too overwhelming and there's too much stuff in there that ends up needing to be moved or whited out all that kind of stuff. So I am just going to put in this washi. I'm using kit 331 again. I have used this in a weekly spread, but I'm using it now because this is a very like tropical themed and uh, kit and we are going on a cruise at the end of this week. So I am using something that's like a little festive in terms of getting ready to go to the Caribbean. So I am using the pineapple washi, I think is what was speaking to me this time around and then I just have some other kind of like colorful stuff to put down like I have these fun little full boxes that I'm going to use colorful labels obviously all of that so I am very very excited um let me put in really quickly the dates and the days of the week it's Monday and Tuesday so I'm going to do Tuesday here, Monday. I've mentioned this. Um, I filmed like a couple of videos. I'm trying to get ahead in my content stuff because September will just be kind of insane. So uh, excuse me if I've said this before, but I have a lot of stuff going on in September. So I'm trying to get ahead on my content. Um, and that just means that I... I'm just doing things a little bit ahead of schedule and hopefully that means that I will have more consistent content and I mean that's kind of how it's supposed to be and I just haven't done it because I didn't really know and maybe if you film videos or you like watch a lot of videos you kind of understand like you almost can't really plan ahead very far with planner stuff because I don't know all the stuff that I have going on like two or three weeks from now. So I can't just sit down one day and plan for like the next month and do videos for the next month. I have to kind of do it like as the weeks come and that is what kind of trips me up with like doing content batching. So I'm trying to do some content batching this time and seeing if I can figure out how to make it work just because when my family is here well we're going on the cruise and then after the cruise my dad and my sister will be here in town and I really don't want to have to film anything or be editing why while, while they're in town so that's kind of my motivation is I'm trying to get ahead so I don't have to be working um, on any of this stuff and obviously I could just say like oh I'm not going to put out any videos but I'm really trying to be more consistent because honestly, I think that I really enjoy this and it's just so much better when I am actually sticking to a schedule. So that is what is going on. But Monday and Tuesday of this week, um, I just have so much to do. Monday is more preparation. Tuesday, my dad arrives from, um, he's traveling down so he can watch our dogs for the week while we're on our cruise. So I am going to put in a label and block out some time for me to go and pick him up. And I think that that is pretty good. I might do 10 to 12 just to be safe. And I always forget that my labels don't cover the time or the, these labels that I grabbed 
don't cover the time. So we have that. The only other label that I want to put in is on Monday. That is when my shop vacation starts. So I'm just going to put a little label up here at the top that says that. So I can remind myself. And of course, if you have dogs and cats, you know that like randomly you'll just get like a piece of fur in your spread. It is so ridiculous. They're not even around me right now. But something just came flying through the air. So that's fun. And I can't even get it off of my sticker. There we go. So, okay, there is that. And that is pretty much it for like scheduled things. I don't have any work um, meetings or anything like that. So what I'm gonna do is um, I've been kind of outlining my work hours in here and then I usually go through and I'll just put like little to-do list items. So I'm gonna do that. I'm using this uh, twin tone marker from Tombow and I'm just gonna mark my work hours specifically so I can kind of block that out. And I hate using straight edges. Like, I don't know if maybe it's only me, but I feel like even with a straight edge, my, my stuff doesn't turn out particularly straight. Um, and let's see. On my work day at 5.30. I have so much to do to prep for my dad being here. Um, not only are we like making sure and getting stuff ready for him to just come and visit, but I also need to make sure that he has everything he needs to like actually watch our house. So that is another big thing um, that I'm trying to do. I need to clean and then also just make sure that like the dogs have everything they need for the next week and all of that. And then my lunch break will end. Right about 1.30. Okay, so there is that. I have work. I have my lunch break here. And a lot of times I will like do something for the shop at lunch. So I kind of put lunch break over to the side and I'm planning to do a couple of things. I might run to the post office or something. Um, on my lunch break, so I'll write that in. And then down here we have uh, the end of the day, but let me put in dinner. We don't have dinner planned, but I'm going to be cooking dinner at that point. Other than that, I don't think there's anything else for Monday. I'm gonna put in my work stuff again on Tuesday. to 530. I've been using a lot of highlighter in my daily duo just to see how it goes and I really do like it. Um, so I, I kind of like alternate between using stickers and highlighters. Um, I did our whole like anniversary spread in highlighter um, and that was really fun. So I think I don't know. I have this line and I'll probably just use the bottom of the label as like my other boundary. Um, but I have my lunch break. I might stop with my dad and get something to eat. So I have to pick him up from the airport. And then the other thing that I'm going to do is I'm going to just put like a little divider here because I want to put his flight information on the sticker too so I know exactly when I need to head out and I can be looking at his flight stuff throughout um, the morning. So also I have here work. 
I have plans to take stickers to the post office and usually if I don't do it like earlier in the day, I'll usually remind myself to go to the post office before the last pickup, which is at 5 p.m. So I have that there. And then other than that, I'm trying to think if there's anything else that I need to like mark off in terms of like workday stuff or using that darker marker. I don't think so. So what I think I will do is I'm going to start putting in some to-do list items and just some of like the main stuff that I normally put in that I need to check off each day. So that is um, just stuff in the morning, like my morning routine. I'm going to write in here that my shop vacation begins. So then I can focus on just doing stickers. And then other than that, I'll just use my gray dot marker. I usually do my 24 hour plan and my water and coffee stuff. I'll wake up early. Um, there's just a few things in the morning that I usually get done. So the first I wake up in the morning and I make and pack lunch for Andrew. Um, it's just, I don't know, something I've gotten kind of in the habit of doing. And then I do my 24 hour plan, which if you aren't familiar with that, that's like food related. So it's not the same as doing like my daily planner. Um, and then coffee and I fill up my water bottle. Um, in between all of that, I have like my morning routine and everything. So that's kind of all laid out already. And I don't really have to write that stuff down, but the whole 24 hour plan thing and the coffee and water are things that I'm consciously working on at the moment. Okay, we have coffee and water. Other than that, I think I might use a couple of these other skinny labels here to mark my like social media stuff that's happening on these days. And so I think in the afternoon here, I'll put one there and then I will put one on this other side, maybe like a little bit earlier. Okay, and so for those, I'm going to do a reminder of my shop vacation on Instagram. I'm doing some reminders earlier um, before it actually goes on vacation, but that's just saying like, Hey, if you go to the Etsy shop, um, and you see it's closed, like that's the reasoning why. And then over here, I will hopefully post a reel. I am not on board with reels fully. I just, I don't know. I'm trying. I'll see if I can kind of get into them. I know it's something that's kind of necessary if you're going to be on Instagram, especially if you have a business, but I am just kind of slowly dipping my toes in. Other than that, let me put in my to-do list stuff. So I have work stuff I'm going to put at the top and then more personal stuff down below. So I have to do a couple tasks for work. Um, what I'm going to do though now is I am going to put like a little piece of washi to divide my work stuff from like my personal to-do list. So that is just going to go right here. I'm kind of using like whatever prints I, I pick up. Like I'm not even specifically <laughs> sticking to one print from this kit, but that is okay. It's all super bright and happy. So that is what I'm kind of focusing on. Um, other than my work stuff, I need to prep the guest bedroom for my dad. I need to clean up the guest bathroom. We don't use the guest bathroom very often or at least I don't. So like, I just need to go in there and make sure that it still looks okay. It stays pretty clean anyways, but <laughs> I just need to make sure. Um, I need to do some vacuuming and just like general dusting. 
stuff like that just in all of like the common areas of the house and then I also want to text my dad and make sure that he is all ready to go and see if he needs anything for when I pick him up the next day. Um, other than that, I will kind of just plug things in f into the day whenever I can. Um, I do need to call, I'm going to put this on the list, but it might end up coming later. Oh, I don't know why. I just put call dad again. I need to, I meant to say call doctor. Um, about a prescription and I need to call our hotel that we're staying at later this week other than that um, I think I will put in at lunch that I'm gonna do some printing and cutting and then run to the post office or maybe not go I think I'm going to the post office on Tuesday so I'll just package up some orders at lunch and then I'll probably work on some stuff after work um, and then I'm using this box down here to do um, breakfast lunch and dinner so I'm gonna leave that blank because I don't know exactly what I'll be eating but then on this side I will put in my to-do list here so um, I don't have a whole lot of stuff for work on this day unless anything gets like moved over. So I just need to do an analysis. I need to complete a presentation. I think that's it for work unless I need to move some things from Monday over to Tuesday. But let me again do like a little divider. Let me do this. I think I'll do it further up here and I need to make some lists for my dad of things around our house that he needs to you know kind of keep in mind for when he's looking for um, or when he's looking after our house while we're gone I need to do a meal plan um, and a list so I can order some groceries and pick them up on Wednesday with dad's input because obviously it's all the stuff that he'll be eating while we're gone. Other than that, I need to do some printing and cutting um, in the morning. And I'm putting this on here in case I get orders like over the weekend that still need to be worked on, but there's a chance that I actually might be done with orders before this if I can get them all done like on Sunday and Monday. So that's kind of nice, but I'm just putting it on here just in case. I have my breakfast, lunch, and dinner here. And then other than that, with lunch break, I don't know if I'll actually do any printing and cutting during lunch just because my dad will be here. But I think what I'll plan to do is maybe take dad like out to eat. It's like just a little thing since he just landed and got in so I think that that is pretty much it for Tuesday um, but kind of the biggest thing is just picking up my dad so anyways I think that's it other than that in the evening um, we'll probably just find like a good show to watch I don't think that there's anything really going on that we have planned um, probably just gonna stick around the house so anyways I think that that is good to go for Monday and Tuesday and then I'll do the rest of the days of the week as we get further through the days as we get further into the week because like I said it gets just a little bit overwhelming if I plan too far ahead of my daily planner but anyways that is it for my daily duo for at least a couple days in preparation for vacation uh, at the end of the week so anyways thank you so much for tuning in and I hope you enjoyed this video I'll talk to you later bye